Hello and welcome to a new series of videos about Electrotechnik. We're talking about the electric field now. And I found something. I sound, found something in the attic here. A little bit dust even on. Uh, der kleine Elektrotechniker, it's called. The little electrotechnician. Uh, it was an experimental uh, thing I had in my, in my childhood. Avec instruction en français. Oh la la. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But not in English. Doesn't really matter. He's also written Made in Yugoslavia. So it has already one or two years of manufacturing, of usage. But it's still there. And for what I am, I want to show you, it's good enough. It's actually, it's, it's a really nice set. Yeah. Oh. Childhood memories. I am using a sheet of paper, small sheet of paper. I'm using some support structure for this sheet of paper, so it does not really matter what. And I'm using this part. This is just some metal part with a isolating handle. Right? And I'm using this. This is a sheet of Polyvinyl chloride, PVC, PVC, plastic. Okay, a sheet of plastic. Now, I will reorganize here my studio. <laughs> Ooh. All right, so I'm going to place here something and my sheet of paper. And the great experiment now is that I I'm getting close to the sheet of paper with a piece of plastic. And it's happening nothing. Whee! <laughs> There's nothing happening. Why should that? Yeah? However, if I'm now taking a uh, tissue yeah, and wrap this, wrap this sheet of, of, of plastic, really rub it, really rub it. And then I'm coming close to my sheet of paper. You see? It sticks. Was on this side. Ah, it's moving. Ah, it also sticks again. Why is that? Huh? Why is that? This is because when I'm rubbing this with a sheet of with a tissue or something like this, I'm going to rub electrons into or electrons off this sheet. Yeah? And I, I leave this thing charged because there is no there is no conductive material, so the charges cannot go anywhere. And whenever this friction charging is done, yeah, I will have a charged material and you can even feel it on on your hairs and so on that this is working yeah wow now it's really working great look at that there are a lot of charges now Ooh. <laughs> this was the first applications of of electric electrotechnic you know wrapping a piece of non-conductive material amber yeah? electron in 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 greek yeah, and then look, look, ooh, your hairs are moving and stuff. Yeah, electrostatic effects. We heard about this force, electrostatic force in an electric field. And I said, okay, this is, this is charged by my rubbing. Yeah, this so, and actually that's already our first, our first piece of interest. Yeah. So if I charge this, then it appears that there is some electric field somewhere. And charges are sources of electric fields. All right. And why is now this piece of, of, of paper attracted to an electric field? This is not charged, right? Yes, that's true. But let's say there are too much electrons on here. 
Yeah? There are also electrons somewhere in this sheet of paper and the electrons will go to the opposite, opposite side. They are not moving very far because it's also a, an isolated material, but they are moving on the other side and what is presented on this side is only the positive remaining charges and they are attracted. Now it's already decharged again because I touched it too often and it's off. Yeah, so that's that's basically just a teaser. Yeah, it's just a teaser uh, of what uh, that we see. All right, we have a force here. Mm -hmm. Next time we will look a little bit more in detail into this behavior, why it is happening, and so on. We will discuss this and see what is. That will also be. Uh, things which are only in our imagination and so on, next video. For this time, for this introduction, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.